What is up, folks? This is Eric Ast, and welcome back to Spiritfarer. So, uh, we had an interesting development. I was able to figure out a way to get my save back, so I didn't have to actually go through the entire story again, um, which I'm very, very grateful for. Um, so, for some reason, the game save or the game installation of um, spirit bearer wouldn't play the cloud saved version or the cloud saved save so when i was able to i in, uninstalled it and eventually i gave up on it after trying to fix it for weeks um so when I was able to uh, get it back. All I had to do was reinstall the game again. <sighs> the simple answers. It's always the simple stuff. It re really is. I mean, that's how I fix my sound. Um, if you guys didn't know, I'd actually talk about this in another video. Um, I My computer died. It was dying for months. Um, <laughs> But it finally died, and I was able to get a processor to, well, wasn't the processor I wanted, but, you know, how it goes these days. It's really hard to find processors. Um, but I was able to get a processor, and, yeah, I was able to finish my build. And unfortunately, as we all know, when you move to a new computer, even if you have saved all your data and all that kind of stuff, eh, things still don't work out perfectly, so... It's been an adventure, um, but we're kind of trying to close, I hope, on the complications, because everything seems to be working all right now. So, uh, yeah, let's talk to these guys and see what they have to say. Uh, and keep in mind, it has been so long um, since I've been fighting sound issues and computer issues and all this other kind of stuff. I barely remember what's going on. So, uh, bye, scrubs and hotkeys. It takes me a little bit to figure something out. Sorry. <laughs> What's up? Are you not the one saying hi? <laughs> My brother's dying over here. We need food. <laughs> the time was 30 minutes ago. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. I wanted to talk to some person saying hi. And I think... Alright, so... I was doing a little bit of grinding off camera. And I think there's actually somebody back here that might be trying to say hi. I could be wrong though. Really, I want this guy to move. Um, I don't. I think you need. Let's just check. I say things. That, yeah, more than one ingredient. Okay, so what do we have that is more than one ingredient? Um, I think rice pudding is. The pork chops are not wonton soup. We can go with that. That's more than one. We go. Finally. Yeah. See, it's behind. Alright, so there's a, this little mushroom guy. So I planted, I think it was like an unknown seedling or something like that. Um, and there's somebody hiding behind the big bull. So, wow! <laughs> Your hat is so big! Yeah, no kidding. Man, look at that cat. Wow. <laughs> Am I in a garden? No. Is this a boat? Yep. On water? <laughs> yep, this is wild. <laughs> Catch this. It was in the ground with me. See ya. Okay, so yeah, there's the little guy. I have no idea what's going on with that, but uh, <laughs> he's kind of cute. He was actually a lot smaller here not too long ago, so. What's going on? No idea what he likes and dislikes. Brings you useless garbage. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that works, I guess. Um, any other point? Oh, needs a home. Alright, so I was able to pick up some materials. And yes, I know there is a common shower going on behind us. I'm just ignoring it for now. So I was able to get some materials before we picked things up. I was trying to just get my feeling for the game again. Um, all right, so build. I think we can build a house. 
for our, yeah, Bruce and Mickey. So, 10 ash planks, or 5, I was going to say 15, uh, 5 cotton fabric, aluminum ingots, times 2, which I have a lot more than that. That's a big one. Um, it actually fits pretty well right here. Not that it looks right. I mean, the ladders line up pretty well. Yeah, I guess we'll put it here. Mini Palace. <laughs> yeah, that's about right. Alright, so can we build anything else? I don't think we have anything else to build right now. Alright. So let's see what they have to say. I wonder if we can go ahead and upgrade it some. Alright, you heading over there? The mini palace is right next to the chicken coop, which I've not used a chicken coop just yet. <laughs> With cars down there, cars in a couch. What you think? Oh, you're not gonna talk to me about it? It's probably because of the comments going on. So I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that, and then I will be back with you guys in just a minute. All right, so yeah, they have something to say to us now. Jeez. This is what I'm talking about. You don't mess around. We need to give you a proper nickname. Mickey, what do you think? Right? I don't like that. It's already taken. Phantom Terror? Oh, that's not good. Give him a minute. <laughs> Sorry, I choked. <laughs> Alright, well anyway, so let's go ahead and head off to our new location. So I've actually done a little bit of exploring, and did my ship's not going to let me go anywhere, is it? No. I still have some more exploring to go. This is actually going over much further than I thought it would. So, the, we don't even see the right side of the map. This is the closest we get in, on the top. So this area is actually a lot bigger than I thought. So we've got Ambertown Park to go to here. We got Oxbury over here. And I ran down to I ran into a small little place down here, Floatsum Shores, and I don't really know what's going on there. So this area is huge. I really did not expect that, because when you see from the outside, all you see is this line right here. But as I go further and further, I'm just like, wow, how big is this area? Um, so, Sandwich Walk is really the only place we've been to, right? No, we've been to a couple more places. Old Town and, uh, oh yeah, the docks are over there. Uh, but anyway, so I will meet you guys back here in a minute. I'd probably head over here, but uh, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see in a second. Alright, so I was just minding my own business, and we ran to something else. So, let's go ahead and stop by over here. So, proof of purchase cow. Okay. And what was the other ones? Or what were the other ones? Um, olive seeds, which I already have a drink. And sugar cane. Okay. Might be something that we want to get. Now, I do need a lot more ingredients for the things that I have recipes for I don't have the ingredients for them. and for the ingredients that I have I don't have recipes for them so there's a lot of slots for them but um, a lot of slots for recipes but I just have not been finding them so let's go ahead and take a look here and yeah I know all those are ready um, I think I'm, most of my trees are ready too yep all right, so let's go ahead and head out. I'll do some farming of that stuff later. Um, I don't know how useful farming actually is, like farming in the sense of trying to get as many resources as you can uh, for the future, because I haven't really needed a 
fun, although food is always an issue. Mm -hmm. No, thank you. Keep walking, you deviant. <laughs> okay. You need to check yourself. Don't come into my face and start asking questions. You ain't the government. Mm -hmm. Plus, I don't answer them either. Back up. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. This place smells like hot garbage on a sunny day. When the sun hits that dumpster just right, you can really smell the dead fish. Our tax glim is hard at work. <laughs> okay. Alright, what have we got? Anything up? Oh, somebody up here. Hello. I'm the Lizard King. Okay. Anything over here? Nope. Okay. Mostly I'll stay on the ground for now. I'll cruise around up there too, but mm -hmm. talk to people. I'll buzz off. Wow, the people around here are really friendly. Hey, you. Hey. Sup? <laughs> the name's Randy. I know, I know. Aren't you merchants all supposed to be called Theodore? Mm. Yes. But not if you stop paying your franchise fees to Raccoon Inc. Listen. Hey. Hear me out. I know what you're thinking. This guy looks shady. Well, that's right. <laughs> that's why I'd cut off my arm and my leg to get you the best prices. Um, okay. Aren't you supposed to be in a car dealership or something? And not just the best prices, the best items. Take a look and remember, my name is Randy and my stock can't be beat. Okay. Uh, interesting. Good for one mint condition cow. <laughs> okay. I'll buy one. Just, uh, you know. <laughs> Alright, so we can buy some olive seeds for uh, some trees. I've thought of actually making a bunch of orchards. I have a good deal of money, but some of the uh, the boat improvements are really expensive. So I thought about making a bunch of those because those seem to be the best way to make money is just to sell uh, whatever you grow on your trees. Um, I'm not entirely sure. You can buy a bunch of sugar cane here too. Um, I don't know what my recipes require is the only thing. So, let's see if I have any gems to sell. But yeah, I mean, you get so many. I mean, it, they aren't necessarily worth a ton. But, you know, in total, especially if you have several olive trees, I mean, they're 120 each. That's, that's not bad. These apples, 40. You know, 40 times 82. That's You're getting up there in money. Um because they produce fairly regularly and you don't have to do anything to them. So, that's a thought. Oh, I didn't actually check the gems there with my next one over, but that's fine, I've got money for now. All right, let's see what else is going on here. That's not actually what I meant to do, but okay. Hello. All right, you animals. <laughs> you should be ashamed of your lack of musical knowledge. Well, I mean, okay. The best song in the world is The Autumn End. No doubt about it. Some rules. Doll face lie. <laughs> Lover's Myth is not only the superior song, it's also technically more interesting. You don't know music. Yeah, that's definitely. That's why I, there was a little bit of hesitance there. I'm like. Are you talking about musical theory? Or are you talking about arguing on an internet forum? <laughs> it's the same song, you jerk. <laughs> the words lover's myth are in the damn lyrics. No, it's not. You don't have good taste and you know nothing. Yeah, I hear you. Settle this thing for us. 
these dumb, dumb idiots say that Autumn End and Lover's Myth are different songs. That's just, just wrong. <sighs> do you play the guitar? Of course you do. Look at those fingers. Calluses the size of mountains. If only you knew the song, you could play the play it for us. Wait a second. I know where you can find the sheet music to the autumn end. It's literally the sports anthem to the city I'm from. Okay. Everyone knows it. Ooh. Uh, sorry. A little bit of an earthquake going on at the moment. Um, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm alive. <laughs> it wasn't actually that bad. Um, the USGS said it was about a 6.0. So, you know, somewhere in the middle range. The problem is it's still going. <laughs> the main earthquake, I guess it lasted about a minute or so, um, which is a long time. Usually it's not that long. Um, and that was it. It was just constantly shaking. That wasn't aftershocks. Um, aftershocks are still going on now. But uh, I don't know. I, it's probably depending on the type of earthquake. But uh, I haven't actually been dealing with earthquakes that long. A little less than a year. Um, but yeah. Well, I mean, I guess that's not true. We had earthquakes in Montana, which was really weird. Um when they did happen. There were two that I can think of. Um, lots of little tiny ones, um, but two actual ones that you would notice. Um, but anyway, so, um, yeah, let's get back to it. <laughs> so, I'm sure you can find a shop on Nordweiler that sells it. See? Yeah, see. Okay, it's got to be, got to be there. Sorry, still a little discombobulated. Uh, here's some pocket change. Keep it, but bring back that sheet music. I feel like I... No. But I feel like I got some sheet music. I just don't remember... Where it is. Hey, guys. So, interesting, huh? <laughs> I'm glad I looked. Nice. Good job finding that sheet music for the autumn end. Now let her rip. Oh, great. I'm not good at this. I am actually much better than at playing actual music than playing keyboard music. <laughs> and by keyboard music, I mean on a mechanical keyboard meant for the computer. I actually wish I had my keyboard. When I moved up here, I could only bring what I could put in my car, so uh, that wasn't a ton. And uh, my keyboard was not one of the things I was able to take. <laughs> All right, so go play the song in the middle there. Let's stop this madness. Unite us. In the middle there? I guess he means right here. Um, oh, I don't have to play. Amazing. I sure know how to rock. Well, it wasn't really a rocking song, but okay. I mean, I liked it, but I told you. I told them. Same song. Thanks for settling this argument. I don't know that they're going to let it be settled, though. Now these so-called music lovers will leave us alone. Yeah. So if you know anything about the way the real world works or rather the uh the internet world in our world um they'll still argue until they're blue in the face don't talk to me we got it the song rolls even more and we're still getting aftershocks okay well i mean it's gonna do its thing 
Okay, so I need to end up on the roof over there. Oh, hey, look at that. So... Aw. Oh. So what I was... I was trying to jump up to that upper one, but I think I could probably just soar up on this one. So let's try it this way. Nope, didn't make it. Can we make it? Oh, actually, maybe I can do it that way. Unless I can do it over here. There we go. We'll do it this way. Alright, there we are. What have we got? A signed vintage poster and some leak seeds. Okay. Well, I mean, we did it. Oh, uh, can I? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I'm going to try it. Let's go over here. And then we'll cruise along. Oh, whoops. I forgot it. <laughs> supposed to hold down or up and uh when you transfer even so let's go like that uh -huh. sweet what do we got <laughs> proof of purchase cow and some beach seeds okay is there anything else over here to go after i imagine there probably is let's jump on this roof uh, nothing so far. Oh, and there's one. Ah, a recipe. Uh, I don't know what that is. I'm not usually caught off guard by things like that. I actually don't know what that, that is. Interesting. I'll have to look that up just to see. I can actually sneak into the window up there. But... So is this it? I'm not gonna see anything else. I should be able to go in there. Okay. What have we got here? Uh, sugar cane and a large glim bottle. Okay. And I guess that's it. I can't get into most of these places, but there's a ladder in there. But there doesn't look like there's anything else in there. Oh, you should be able to get in there from up top, but I mean, what's the point? All right, Aftershocks. Stop it. I don't even know how many that's been. There's been a lot of them. All right, so anyway. I will continue heading towards that other island, and I will meet you guys over there. So I will see you in a second. All right, so we actually ran into another place on our way to where we were going. And that place is... Sun Spring Square. So, don't know what's going on here, but I figure we'll check it out. And we also... Somebody has somebody talking. Um, I want to... No, not edit. I want to improve. So, I think it's this one. Yeah, we can improve our crusher with, ironically, or maybe unironically, things that we can get by using the crusher. So... Anything that will help us, or help me, not have to grind so much, uh, is extremely useful. So this will help us yield more resources from the things that we use. So, let's go ahead and improve it. Now, I also want to check on some other things. So we need a sheet of clear glass. Now, I know we can get glass. I'm not sure how to get clear glass, or a sheet. Uh, so I'll have to look into that. Um, I have all the other materials otherwise. I don't need anything from there. What I want to see really is our new building. Oh, okay, so we don't even know what it's going to do yet. Uh, so it looks like... Seriously? Okay, so a chandelier. <laughs> which I need a bronze sheet and crystal glass sheet. Um, we're going to set up a TV with a uh, man and a woman holding speakers on their shoulders. Okay. And 
a table with uh, who knows what that is? A whiskey, bourbon. I don't know. We'll see. All right, so let's go over here. Oh, side comment here: I'm not a huge bourbon fan. Uh, my grandmother is, and it, she's like the bourbon fan. She loves bourbon, uh, so. No, I'm not going to tell that story. Uh, I'm not going to tell the story of how I learned that this was a bourbon that was really good. Um, it's nothing entirely shady or anything like that. Uh, I probably just made things worse. Um, but I had someone give me a an amount of uh, this bourbon once. Um, they were having to... They were on vacation and they were flying back home and um yeah so i tried this jackson reserve um and i have to say i'm not a bourbon fan but i am a fan of this bourbon it was really good it was also like 80 or 90 dollars a bottle so uh not entirely cheap uh, not super expensive. I mean, if you go with whiskeys especially, you can get... And yes, I know bourbon is a whiskey. But if you go with whiskeys and really go down that rabbit hole, uh, just like wines, you can get really, really expensive. But anyway, Scout. I got another errand for you to run. This one is fixing up a problem you created. You gave us a house, which is nice and all. However, it's empty. It's got nothing. You need to add some pizzazz to it. Nikki has always had a certain lavish lifestyle. However, I can't tell you what he wants. You just have to figure that out. We're not interior designers. We're a vice scout. Just get whatever is old, expensive and loud. Great. He's going to be that neighbor that no one wants. Every time somebody comes by and just driving down the street that has a really loud bass speaker in it, it pisses me off. So, he's going to be that guy. <laughs> anyway, so, let's go ahead and take a look and see what we can find here. Are you going to tell me to go away too? The last people told me to go away. I've been out here grind or gritting? What's gritting? And busting for, for the dice game. Respect the dice boys. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't... <laughs> I was singing along to this song. Really? Because I thought you were high on something. <laughs> that was <pretty> good. <laughs> oh, are you sure you're not high on something? Because... Okay. Friend. Do you know my friend's Ma my friend Marianne's address? No, can't say I do. Well, thanks anyway. Sure. Let's lock too. Everybody's locking their doors these days, not allowing me to break in when I want to. It's not very nice, you know. I mean, a person should be allowed to break in when they want. Okay, I almost said something really snarky about that, um, but I said I wouldn't. So I'm not going to. You can infer as you please. Oh. What are you doing? Yes, I see that blackberry bush, but <laughs> good grief. Oh. Welcome to the park. My name is David, and I'm one of the many rangers in charge of our region's parks. Just wanted you to know that these trees are sick. They have a rare disease. We need to cut them down got a crew coming later. Just wanted to warn you to be safe in the park. 
to respect the park, to serve your community. Hmm. Have a park fill day. I mean, I guess I could cut them down, but this doesn't seem very nice. Wow, berries. Well, I'll tell you what. Because this is a game, it's really weird. Uh, come back here. I was going to feed you some of the berries that you could have gotten yourself. <laughs> here you go. It's a blueberry. Oh, well, they're blueberries, not blackberries. They look like blackberries. Yep. Well, I mean, you were standing in front of them. All right. Well, you wanted to cut the trees down, so I'll cut your trees down. He's probably going to yell at me in a minute. Oh, no, you're not going to say anything new. I figured you would say something, oh, but okay. I mean, that would be the perfect time to say something. Somebody cuts down the tree in your park right in front of you, even though you said you wanted the trees cut down, but... It's got the really loud falling trees, which... Okay, I know that statement did not... <laughs> As someone who has... All right, so I haven't cut the trees down. But my family has cut the trees down, and I was there, and I chopped them up after they had been chopped down. Or cut down, because you didn't use an axe to chop them down. Well, that's not necessarily true, because sometimes you need to finish it off. But anyway, yeah. Use a chainsaw. <laughs> I've done plenty of wood splitting, alright? <laughs> Hide yourself. Can I go in this one? Nope, my one's locked in. Okay. Everybody's locking their doors. All right, don't want me to come in, that's oh. fine. Directions? I always just go left and right. But if you want a flashy place to visit, oh. I'd rather heard about this spot filled with giant screens. Yes, I... No, he wasn't lying. It is absolutely obnoxious. All right, so I guess that's... I can't get up there. I don't know how to get up there. How do we get up there? I want up there. I don't see that there's anything actually up there to get to. There's a vent or a uh, air conditioning unit we can jump on top of. Or maybe this is something we come back to later. Um, can we get on top of this? Nope. So there is just the post over here. Yeah. Oh, we can get on top of that. Interesting. Well, I don't think it's anything that we can do right now anyway. We may be able to. Oh, oh, I screwed that one up. All right, I'll try it one more time. Let's be honest, I'll probably try it as many times as it takes to do it. But, you know, for the sake of uh, whatever. <laughs> Well, I'm not going to try it again, right? That's one of those. That's what that is. All right, one more time. What? I held up. Why wouldn't... <sighs> wouldn't let me grab hold of it. That was really weird. Huh. Oops. Sorry. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just come back to this later and see if I can, I can get in because right now it doesn't want to let me. Um, I held up for both times, which is usually all you need to do. Um, but don't know. Alrighty. So it looks like we have actually run it up against the end of the episode. Uh, I've actually been recording longer than I thought I had. So today, we're just gonna stay inside and get some sleep. I think it's a pretty good idea. Oh, that's 
falling down right out there. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the episode, um, including the interruption of, you know, an earthquake. Um, I've actually recorded through earthquakes before, but they're fairly small. They weren't super big. Um, this one, eh, it's in kind of in the middle. Um, but anyway, so yeah. So we have got our spirit fair back and going, which I am so happy about. Uh, I, I was wanting to find out, okay, not necessarily ending. I was wanting to end our journey enough that I was going to play through the whole game over again, which we've done quite a few episodes and I've done quite a few, uh, hours off screen, uh, recording. So that was going to be a fairly long journey. It probably wouldn't have taken quite as long to get back to the point where we are now as it did to get there because I wouldn't be reading aloud and uh, doing the extraneous chatting and going off on tangents that I normally do. Uh, but it would have taken a while. Um, I'm not sure how long. I'd say probably at least 15 hours. Uh, that's just a guess. But... Uh, 10, 15 hours to get here, I imagine. Uh, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, and let's look forward to seeing what else comes up in the future. All right, so have a wonderful day, and take it easy. <laughs>